male reproductive system this system is constituted by various organs like a pair of testes singular testes which are called as two sperm ducts and a penis testes produce millions of male gametes called as sperms a sperm is a single cell which is very small in size each sperm is made up of a head a middle piece and a tail female reproductive system it comprises of a pair of ovaries oviducts which are otherwise called as fallopian tubes and the uterus ovaries produce female gametes called as ova that is eggs an ovum is a single cell which is released into oviduct by one of the ovaries every month uterus is a bag like structure which helps in the development of the baby fertilization it is the first step in the process of reproduction only one sperm fertilizes the ova during which sperm and the egg fuse to form a single nucleus called as a zygote fertilization takes place inside the female body and is called as internal fertilization as the egg is produced by the mother and the sperm is produced by the father both of them fuse to form a new individual zygote and it inherits its characteristics both from its father and mother internal fertilization is seen in humans cows dogs and hens external fertilization is the process in which fusion of male and female gametes takes place outside the body example during rainy season frogs move to the ponds where female lays hundreds of eggs in water sperms move randomly in water and fertilize the eggs development of an embryo the zygote divides repeatedly to give rise to a ball of cells the cells begin to develop into tissues and organs of the body this developing structure is called as an embryo the embryo gets embedded in the wall of uterus and continues to develop into a fetus fetus is the developed embryo whose body parts can be easily identified mother gives birth to the baby viviparous and oviparous animals the animals which give birth to young ones are called as viviparous animals the animals which lay eggs are called as oviparous animals in oviparous animals after fertilization the zygote divides and travels down the ovida as it travels down many protective layers are formed around it and finally it is covered by a hard shell which acts as a protective layer after the embryo develops into chick it bursts open the egg shell and comes out young ones into adult in a frog the individuals which hatch out from the egg undergo a process of metamorphosis by which they are transformed into an adult the different stages observed in the life cycle of a frog are egg larva and adult larval stage is called as a tadpole which is capable of jumping and swimming 